Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Translating Java code to C++ involves several steps due to the differences in syntax, memory management, and object-oriented features between the two languages. Below is a tutorial that outlines the key differences and provides an example of how to convert basic Java code to C++. Hashtag 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 key differences between Java and C++. 1. Memory Management Java uses automatic garbage collection, while C++ requires manual memory management using new and delete. 2. Syntax while Java and C++ share a similar syntax, there are differences in type declaration, method definitions, and access modifiers. 3. Standard Libraries Java has a rich set of libraries in the Java Standard Library, while C++ uses the Standard Template Library, STL. 4. Main Method Java requires a main method to run the program, while C++ can have a simple main function. 5. Inheritance and Interfaces C++ supports multiple inheritance directly, while Java uses interfaces to achieve similar functionality. Hashtag 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 example, translating Java code to C++. Let's take a simple Java program and convert it to C++. The Java program will be a simple class that calculates the area of a rectangle. Hashtag 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 Java code. Hashtag 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 step by step translation to C++. One class definition, the public keyword is not needed, instead, we can use public or private where necessary. Two constructor, the constructor syntax is different. 3. Method Definition, Type Declarations are similar, but we need to specify the return type and use std_cut for output in C++. 4. Main Function, Instead of a main method, we will define a standard main function. Hashtag 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 C++ Code Hashtag 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 Explanation of C++ Code 1. Include Directive Hashtag include I a stream is necessary for input and output operations. 2. Class definition, the class is defined similarly, with access modifiers private and public. 3. Constructor, the constructor initializes length and width using the this pointer to differentiate between the parameters and the class attributes. 4. Output, std code is used for printing to the console, and std and l is used to insert a new line. 5. Return type, the main function returns 0 to indicate successful execution. Hashtag 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 compiling and running. To compile and run the C++ code, you can use a C++ compiler like G++. Here's how you can do it. 1. Save the C++ code to a file named rectangle.cpp. 2. Open your terminal or command prompt. 3. Navigate to the directory where rectangle.cpp is saved. 4. Compile the code using the command. 5. Run the compiled program. You should see the output. Hashtag 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 conclusion. Converting Java code to C++ involves understanding the differences in syntax, memory management, and libraries between the two languages. The example provided illustrates a simple class and method translation from Java to C++. Once you grasp these differences, you can work on more complex translations, ensuring to account for C++ features like pointers and manual memory management where necessary.